please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. What up Wildcats? I'm Michaela and I'm Abby and this is your Jungle Report for Wednesday, September 8th. The junior class is looking for students to sell programs at the home football games on September 10th and September 17th. Please sign up on Miss Appia's door, room 115, if you're interested. The final day to sign up for the Art Squad or Pep Club on Google Classroom is today. Any Pep Club or Art Squad members that signed up for the Week 1 dance are making signs Please attend a brief 15-minute meeting after school this Thursday, August 9th. Anyone who would like to sign up to be a member of the Future Teachers Interact or Medical Careers Club, please sign up in Ms. Migler's room after the school this week. Friday will be the last day to join, and you will not be able to join the clubs after this date. If you were a member last year, the Google Classroom codes are new, so please join the new classrooms for updates and announcements. Anyone who would like to sign up to work the concession stand before and or during the football game this Friday, sign up outside of Ms. Mickler's room. There will be a meeting after school Thursday, September 9th for anyone interested in signing up for the drama club. The meeting will be in Mr. Pape's room number 217 and should only last about 15 minutes. Last call for any students interested in joining Spanish club this year. Please sign up outside of Ms. Politsky's room number 117. The fee to join is $5 and can be turned into Ms. Politsky. Please have your fees turned in by this Friday, September 10th. Attention seniors, the Mahoning County Educational Service Center and the Skills Trade Organization is hosting a Skills Trades Expo on Wednesday, September 22nd. The expo will include exhibits from many local trade unions. To RSVP your spot, please fill out the Google form located on the Class of 2022 cl Google Classroom. Attention all students interested in the ACT exams. The deadline for the October 23rd ACT test is September 17th with a no late fee. If you have questions about registration or you think you're eligible for a free waiver, please see Ms. Weitzman or Ms. Dubas. Homecoming tickets are on sale now during all lunches. Tickets are $25 each. Please turn in a completed form with your money by Friday, September 10th. No late tickets will be sold. Don't miss out on a great time. From the athletic department, there will be a brief meeting Thursday, September 9th at 3.15 in the cafeteria for those interested in playing baseball in the spring. Come meet the new coach, sign up, and hear off-season plans. If you can't make it, be sure to sign up on final forms. And now for today's forecast. Showers in the morning, then partly cloudy in the afternoon. A high of 76, and the winds will be out of the southwest at 5 to 10 miles per hour. Most clear, mostly clear skies in this evening, a low of 54, and the winds will be light and variable. And here's what's happening in Wildcat sports. Today, the girls' tennis team has a home match against Warren G. Harding. Match starts at 4 o'clock. Good luck, Lady Cats. The girls' volleyball team is also at home to battle Springfield local for their senior night. The JV game starts at 5.30, and the varsity game will follow right after. Come support our seniors. Good luck, girls. And the girls' soccer team is on the road tonight in Niles to battle the Red Dragons. Game time is 7 o'clock. Good luck, girls. Just remember, fans, in case of inclement weather, athletic schedules are subject to change. You've been watching the Jungle Report for Wednesday, September 8th. I'm Michaela. And I'm Abby. Have a great day, and we'll see you tomorrow.